Man Collision series coming up. Collision Wi-Fi series coming up. I don't know if I just reached close for that. Or did we be able, be able to better tell you? But please support the man. And all right, we got Sonic versus Pokemon Trainer. And if you've been watching the chat at all, which I know you haven't on YouTube, it has been kind of a uh, standoff this whole time. So let's see how this goes. <laughs> Alright, good, uh, good, good start for, uh, a really good start for Beast, honestly. <laughs> There's not many characters that are like, oh, you're, you're blitzing? Oh, that's bad. And just runs away and then turns around and grabs you. Jesus, Sonic! <laughs> I'm not used to talking this much, my throat's starting to hurt. <laughs> Alright, Zach managed to get like a pretty strong lead overall on uh, on Beast. He's clearly looking for the opportunity to just kind of take the stock lead, but Beast is doing a great job of not giving him like any very significant openings. Of course, Beast is playing a heavy. So that does mean that uh, any stray hit for these can result in stock a lot sooner. Okay, I didn't actually know that that was his taunt, and uh, he distorted the air with the sound of his uh, with the sound of his voice. Jeez, I'm sorry. That's cool. That's actually a really cool taunt for the Charizard. It's like, yeah, if your opponent is standing on the other side of the stage and you refuse to, uh, to interact with you, you may as well taunt. Sonic Speed. What? Who said that? And just like that, we have a uh, we have a patience match. So unlike Lucas, um, Charizard doesn't really have the tools to camp back at uh, at Sonic, and I don't really know like what he can do besides just try to force an approach and eventually get the kill. But it's like Sonic just gets to play on his terms, and he's taking a lot of damage here. Jeez, dude. <laughs> There it is, there's the Flare Blitz. He let it rip, and it's like, he got rewarded for it. So I respect it. <clears throat> Anybody wants to cast with me, with me on this? I would really appreciate it. I don't know why I'm expecting myself to this. <laughs> I mean, my god. <laughs> Beast uh, trying to exert some kind of ledge pressure. Of course, Sonic doesn't really care about it, but you know that. Good DI on the spin dash. Avoiding. Okay. Yeah, Zaka as the Ying, very unfortunate. I can, I can hear Beast right now ca t talking about how how he deserves it. But this is uh, the first lead that uh, Beast has had this whole match. So I'm really interested in seeing if he's going to be able to hold it or just lose the stock immediately. Nope, it is Charizard. So he is a big, beefy boy. Sonic F took 100% an option to finish the, the match. Right? He finished the stock! Jesus! Boo! That back here, dude. Putting in work. Okay. Uh, Beast actually getting in a good amount of damage. This match has actually kind of turned around for uh, for B significantly. That SD, uh, Zach was feeling himself a little bit too much and made a major mistake, causing the second stock. And we're getting some lag spikes. It looks like. Uh, Devin, do you have any info on where the lag spikes are coming from? Coming from Beast? Okay. Yeah, we have a uh, we have a lag detector now. So I guess Beast is getting so mad it's causing him to right lag. now. Oh my God, packets right now are about eighteen to one, nineteen to one, twenty to one, twenty-two to one. Oh my God, Beast, your router is exploding, bro. What is happening? You can't handle the sonic speed, bro. Come on. Yeah, we do have a uh, lag detector now, so like we can't we actually know where the lag is coming from? And unfortunately, it's coming from Beast. Not unfortunately, so much as, it, yeah, coming from the east, and 
it kind of sucks when you're fighting a, a Sonic with any kind of lag. But you know, sometimes uh, internet connections just decide to crap the bed. Not great. Networks are from hell, so yeah. Networks are from hell. And yeah, this is best of five, so you know, guys, uh, buckle in. You guys, uh, the new network technology brought to us from Nerf underscore zero. Uh, they do online ladders and streams over at twitch.tv slash Nerf underscore zero. Nerf is a really cool guy. You should totally support him in his efforts to make Wi-Fi not suck as much. His lag detector is already coming in handy. It's kind of amazing. And thank you to Brady for putting us in contact with him, too. Brady's the man. And guys, if you have a LAN adapter, keep in mind it is very common for a for the LAN adapter to not be active on turning on the switch. Uh, the best way to make sure that your LAN adapter is working is to unplug it and plug it back in if it's not flashing, and to also remove all of your Wi-Fi networks if you only use your switch at home on dock, because that will definitely keep you from using a not LAN. Oh god, I looked away for like half a second and this man is dead! He's taking a legitimately strong opening lead. Beast is literally dropping one packet for 10 seconds. Yeah, I'm gonna have to tell a man to, to reset the router or something. I also don't want to make okay. this take longer. It's not going up anymore. It's only at four. Oh! oh! <laughs> what? I think I'll okay. end up putting this on the overlay as well for these tournaments, too. Yeah. Uh, I'm not necessarily, like... I don't necessarily want to DQ uh, He lags a lot just because it's like you can't really control it and he's been like playing well. Uh, from mm. You know what? I respect it. I 100% res I respect it. It's like it's a punchable face. You want to punch it and you can grab it when he goes, Sonic Speed! Uh, and he's like, he's still invincibility, so you probably shouldn't have tried to punch his face. <laughs> I, uh, good, 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 good kill. Good, good, good S-Mash. He's like, I'm the one who punches your face, boy. Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> Everybody hates it here. <laughs> I'm just looking at the chat, and everyone's just so mad about that smash. Oh! Okay, that was a really good read, and he almost died. He almost died. Of course, it is a. Uh, it was Sonic at like what? Almost. Okay. Okay. Uh, how's this gonna end? Oh man, he got clawed in the back. My man's got clawed in the back. So there's a question now: is uh, what kind of F or F D type stage are we going to? I <laughs> I have no words for this, dude. Like what the <laughs> yeah, that was a good match, but oh my goodness. Alright, so we have Beast who's banning 
I guess we'll see where uh, where we're gonna go. With Sonic, Sonic. All right, so Beast Man, FD, and Kalos. The exact stages that would be expected to be Man versus Sonic. And we are going to hmm, pick a stage. Pick a stage back. We're going to two. Town and City! FD3, supposedly, according to some people. It does have platforms, though, so you can still, like, you can kind of force Sonic to still approach by being on the platform if you're smart about it. I still have to give, uh, I have to give Zach a lot of credit for that cocky little taunt into s -Mash. That was actually very funny. I know people were really mad about it in the chat, but you know, whatever, man. Sometimes uh, you try to grab an invincible man and you get dumped in the face. Ready? Oh, we fit trainer. Zach is like, all right, whatever. I'm going we fit. Really? Are you sure? <laughs> Are you certain? Three, two, one, I mean, okay. Go! Yeah, I don't really have, like, anything to say about this besides, okay. This is a matchup that, um, I don't know how much experience Beast has of it. I'm pretty sure Numbers and Beast have fought before, but I don't... And I know, like, uh, I think Numbers has a good record against Beast, or at least, like, a decent one. Uh, I'm sure Numbers can confirm one way or the other. This is also a trainer battle. This is Reef the Trainer versus Pokemon Trainer. This is also like a big thing about fighting people who play characters that are considered the main. Is that like they still have to play the character and like win with them. So like if they get tired of the game plan that the character has, then you know they're gonna they're gonna want to switch off too. Even if what? Excuse me. What was that? Was that was that was that was that header? Was that was, did header like stop the flare blitz? Okay, well, that actually like took me out of the game so much. Um, Charizard, of course, surviving forever and ever. But you no, know, deep breathing with the trainer. She has kill throws. She has. Every single area aerial of her kills now. She got F smashed. This is not going well. Ah, Charizard just looking for the jump. Good job, uh, from Beast. With that really good back air. And this man is gone, he's dead, he has expired, and he has ceased to be. He has gone to the blast zone where you may meet him for lunch. But you know what? You'll be there soon too, so it's all good. Let me see that spike. <laughs> Yo, good stun salutation though. My man is, my man is, uh, whatever the hell it's called. I don't even know what they call it when you do downloads, but I'm, like, so blunt and hard. I'm sure someone's gonna correct me. Teabagging. There you go, teabagging. Charizard with the worst teabag in the game. It feels, like, honestly the worst teabag in the game. But, uh, that was kind of a really weird game three. I don't know why Zach decided to <laughs> just give up game three like that. That was really interesting. I don't, I don't know. I don't know, man. I got I got to question the decision to go we fit, honestly. And again, uh, Beast is banning FD and Kalos. We can see where... Uh, where Zach is gonna take him, and if he's gonna insist on going Beefit again or someone else, maybe he'll go Samus or something. I don't know. So, was that the soccer ball? What happened? How did he not die there? I can, can we see that again in slow mo? That uh, that flare blitz that did nothing. Yeah, the first kill where there was like a flare blitz that did nothing. Can we, can we see that in slow mo, like slower mo? Because I can't see no. anything. Like, look, he just doesn't die. Why didn't he die? That was weird. Okay, whatever. 
All right, we're back to Sonic versus Trainer, and we're on town again. I don't know why he went refit for game three, but I guess uh, we'll see if this, he's going to bite him in the butt, if he's going to be able to just turn it around and win two more games of Sonic. Yeah. You know, you guys, uh, you can enjoy the the wonderful sound for a minute. I'm gonna take it. It's gonna I have returns. I have uh, brought water to soothe my throat and mochi to soothe my soul. And now I'm 
going to pop open my bag, my box of delicious deluxe mochi that I bought three weeks ago for a rainy day because this is making me sad. So it'll be interesting to see uh, where Beast decides to take um, Sonic. I'm assuming probably Battlefield again, because that's where he won uh, Game 2, I think. I'm not sure, actually. If I recall correctly. Let me double check the, uh, the match. Mm. Okay, so Game 2 was on PS2. Okay, they were playing on PS2. They're going back to PS2. Okay. All right, so going back to PS2 again. Uh, it's going to be uh, Satanic Ready? versus Cher Resort again, I guess. A lot of flare blitz is coming out of uh, coming out of beast, really. Game five situations, dude. Jeez, come on. Man. I did not expect that. All right, again, Zach holding the lead. Uh, beast is kind of having a tough time. Really of course, uh, beast has won a game earlier where there was a lot of camp going on. And eventually, and it was even coming back from like a really bad deficit. So. If nothing, you can say that Beast actually has a really good mental fortitude and a really good read there on the homing attack. Nice up smash. You can see, like, he's completely changing up his tactics. He's like, yeah, Charizard hasn't been working that well. Maybe I could try Ivysaur. And yeah, Ivysaur has really good damage output, it has really huge hitboxes, and he's got out the, uh, the, the approach really well. He can put in work for you really well. Because a big part of that is that uh, Ivysaur's disadvantage state isn't the greatest. So if Sonic gets you in the air, you have to kind of figure out how to land. I know it's gonna be a Sonic S smash. Oh no, he ran back for some reason. I'm not really sure I understand why. And a really good, a really good Nair. Uh, uh, where was that forward air? I don't even know. I'm like so lost in the sauce right now. Oh, and an uh, an awful DI. Awesome. It was Nair? Okay, thank you. Ben. An awful DI costing uh, Beast stock, and now it's suddenly extremely even. Nobody really has a lead right now. And four minutes is an insane amount of time to try to time someone out. So this is definitely not going to be a timeout. Unless both players decide to just stop playing. The piece is like, no, I'm going to assert, I'm going to assert my, uh, I'm going to assert the fact that I have a very small lead. It is a lead. Even if it's not huge. This man is back on Charizard. He's like, yo, now's your chance. Oh my god, why would you do Ghetto? Why? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just like so. I'm so taken aback by that get up at 
like, this man got deleted. 62%. You know, 62% of neutral getup against a Charizard charging F Smash. He's not going to miss that. And Beast is out here in the, um, Beast is out here in the chat being like, ugh. Just talking all that good trash. I, I can imagine the frustration right now. I was like, let's try to keep it civil, guys, please. Um, all right, so Beast, uh, despite your frustrations, uh, we're not, we're gonna have you on stream next. So come back. This is incredibly uncivil. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude, this was, this was something. Okay. I know I'm not supposed to be in here, but why would you neutral get up in that situation? That's what I was asking. Also, Brady doesn't really, it's not like he's that professional. I'm in here for God's sake. If you want to cast Sonic vs. Pokemon Trainer, you're welcome to join me, but now it's too late, so I can't even do that. <laughs> I joke. I joined specifically between sets, so I didn't interrupt anything. Girl, you're not interrupting anything. I literally went to go <laughs> get water and mochi.